Okay. Good afternoon. I'm Greg Bazard and with Agilent Technologies here at Electronica. And what we're showing today at the show is one of our latest solutions for DDR memory. One of the challenges with DDR memory is being able to accurately capture the information off a very high speed bus. And at the same time, how do you do that when the package type is ball grid array? So what Agilent has invented is a new BGA probe that actually goes on to the board under test. On this board, we solder down the Agilent device, and on top of it, we solder down the actual DDR memory system itself. And now we're able to very easily connect up the Agilent logic analyzer. With these flexible wings, you don't have a problem with clearance of other devices underneath or next to the chip. We can also very easily connect up the oscilloscope to this device. By being able to look at the DDR memory with the logic analyzer, we can see all of the activity and decode it. So we can see reads and we can see writes. So if you write information to a memory location and read it back, the logic analyzer is able to not only capture that and decode it, but it's able to allow you to debug it, to trigger on events, to trigger on problems. We do the same thing with our 9000 series oscilloscope, which gives you a very high speed scope at 13 gigahertz that gives you the bandwidth you need to look at memory applications. The same type of probing solution with this flexible circuit is available for the oscilloscope, or you can use our Infinimax probes and solder them directly to the coupling capacitor on the board for the highest quality of signal integrity and now you can actually look at the electrical characteristics of the device under test as well. So only Agilent brings you both the ability to probe the system, look at it in terms of protocol or state capture, and look at the signal integrity with a very high quality, high bandwidth scope. All of the Agilent scopes also support the ability to validate and verify DDR um, automatically. So there are automatic tests built in here that will verify that you're compliant with the JDEX spec. Thank you.